Russia has amassed tens of thousands of troops on the border of Ukraine in an escalating crisis which could lead to war with the former Soviet state. Joe Biden has called the Russian president to urge him to stand down his soldiers and military equipment. Currently on the Russia-Ukraine border, we are seeing a quite a large uh, military buildup uh, by Russia. You're seeing in Western Russia, i.e. Eastern Ukraine, that border, uh, the Russians themselves have told us that two armies and three paratroop units have been moved into position. Other units have also uh, been clandestinely spotted uh, by satellite and other uh, means. And you've also got a mobilization occurring um, in Crimea, which of course was illegally annexed by Russia back in 2014. So basically, Ukraine is facing a cordon of steel on both its eastern and southern borders. And everyone, of course, is wondering uh, what this is all about and, and why it's happening. So the Russians have given various reasons uh, and keep on switching their reasons for why they're uh, attempting this mobilization. Uh, we've gone through it's a military drill to we're resisting NATO aggression to we're worried about the civil war uh, restarting in eastern Ukraine. But essentially, none of those reasons really holds uh, much sway. I mean, there is no NATO military aggression, for example, uh, on the, in, in the region at all. Experts believe the Russian president may have ordered the mobilization of more than half a million troops to the region, involving forces from the Pacific to the Baltic. Meanwhile, the Ukrainian military, which is outnumbered by Russia by a factor of three to one, say they are preparing to repel tank and infantry attacks near the border of Russian annexed Crimea. US President Joe Biden called Vladimir Putin on Tuesday to reaffirm America's support of Ukraine's sovereignty and proposed a summit between the two presidents. However, the Kremlin said any such meeting would be premature, though they would keep dialogue open with the US. Stephen Edgington, The Sun.